Good fine evening, fellow YouTubers. King Cobra JFS, an internet anomaly, a charismatic enigma, and someone who has quite a lot of lore to him. Whether you're a veteran of all things Cobra, just started getting into King Cobra JFS, or aren't familiar with him at all, and clicked on this video out of sheer curiosity, you've made a good choice. Because I cover King Cobra a lot on my channel, and recently while browsing the King Cobra JFS subreddit, I found something very interesting. I found this. A King Cobra JFS iceberg. I'm sure if you're watching this video you're somewhat familiar with the concept of an iceberg, but if you're not, I'll quickly explain it. An iceberg is a list of things about a certain topic that get nicher and nicher as we go down the iceberg. And there is quite a lot to unpack here in this King Cobra JFS iceberg about our Lord and Saviour King Cobra, Josh Saunders. So let's get right into it, starting with entry number one on this here iceberg. Oh yeah, and also a big shout out to Reddit user Jailbert Campbell for this here iceberg. This thing is amazing, so all the credit for this iceberg goes to him. And uh, yeah, anyways, entry number one drink combos this entry on the iceberg refers to the very common title cobra uses on a lot of his videos and live streams drink combos these videos and streams usually consist of josh making a mixed alcohol beverage usually mixing a beer with an energy drink or like a whiskey or other spirit with an energy drink there's a lot of energy drinks involved and then ranting about usual cobra topics like gender relations and black magic and shit Gender relations. Gender relations is in reference to a topic Josh discusses a lot on his channel, that being, well obviously gender relations. Josh, for some reason, despite never really being in a successful romantic relationship, and he's also not been involved in intimacy for like five or six years, thinks that he's some sort of like relationship psychology expert. It's just another thing that makes him absolutely ridiculous. Response video. Response videos is in reference to another common overused title for Josh's videos and live streams, response video, usually spelt with a C like you saw there. These videos and streams consist of Josh quote unquote responding to another YouTuber, usually like an anti SJW YouTuber like Sidney Watson or Blair White. These streams are really boring and Josh has no idea what he's talking about like 99% of the time. Nah, scratch that. Josh never has any idea what he's talking about. Warlord and Darth Linny. This entry on the iceberg refers to two of Josh's nearest and dearest buddies, Darth Linny B, aka Michael Baldwin, no relation to Alec, and Warlord Alex Campbell. Darth Linny is a super likable, sweet dude who usually wears an American Eagle vest with pride written on it and kinda resembles Jack Black and Alex Campbell. Alex Campbell, or as he refers to himself as Warlord Campbell, is this really unlikable, tweaker, meth head dude who just generally sucks. He hangs around Josh. He used to before they got into a fight and yeah, he's just kind of like a manipulative piece of shit asshole. Moving on. Cooking videos. Cooking videos refers to Josh's cooking videos where Josh is making anything from a dank burger or dank fries. You all know it's going to be greasy and terrible. These cooking videos Josh does can be hours long and just downright unwatchable sometimes. But, you know, that's what's up. It's all worth it to see him bite into a burger and watch the grease drip down his arm. Alcoholism. Fucking hell, this got dark quick. This entry on the iceberg refers to, well... Josh's alcoholism. It's no secret King Cobra has a bit of a drinking problem. Pretty recently he couldn't go out for a meal with his family on his 31st birthday because he was too drunk. He's gotten into drunken brawls with his friends on camera and has generally been drinking himself to death for like the last three or four years. It's very sad but hey, it's what gets him the views. I do want to take the time in this video to say that this is a very sensitive topic and I do genuinely wish Josh the best and I hope he gets the help he deserves because I do love the guy. I think everyone in this community who watches him this frequently like loves him in some way and seeing him get better would be amazing and 
Yeah, that's what's up. Bite Size This entry on the iceberg refers to a YouTube channel called Bite Sized Cobra Videos, a channel that takes Josh's very long content and cuts it down to the best of the best. It's pretty much a Cobra highlight channel, and the only way a sane person could ever watch King Cobra JFS is dog shit, boring videos. Bite Size is an absolute hero and is definitely a key player in the success of Josh because, you know, he finds the bits that are actually funny in the sea of, you know, the three hour, really long, really boring stuff. So, huge shout out to Bite Size. What a legend. Tactical Soap. This entry on the iceberg refers to King Cobra's obsession with Bond Tactical Pheromone Soap which is, you know, a pheromone soap that he claims makes women, like, lust over him, and they're all over him. And they always say the same line. They say, hmm, that goth guy smells really good. It's just another one of these ridiculous obsessions Josh has. Like, with Chi Balls and Ozzy Osbourne and shit. He's convinced this Bond tactical soap shit is, like, just gonna get him all the pussy one day. Custom pizzas. This entry on the iceberg is referring to the ridiculous custom pizzas Josh orders with like 10 fucking toppings on them and eats on camera. All of these custom pizzas he gets are pretty pricey, sometimes being upwards of like $60. It, it's not like he couldn't get much more food in like a meal deal if he just had any common sense at all, but he just doesn't. So he gets these huge, ridiculous custom pizzas instead and wastes a shit ton of money on them. Food Hacks Food Hack is just another overused Josh title, like Response Video and Drink Combo. Food Hack refers to Josh eating garbage combos of junk food and saying a whole lot of nothing. That's what's up. Passing Out on Stream Cobes has passed out on stream a lot, usually under the influence of alcohol. One of the most infamous and funniest incidents of this happening was when him and Darth Linney drank loads of Budweiser and called it the Budweiser Challenge. I don't know what, like, it wasn't a challenge, it was just two guys drinking 20 beers. And it's pretty hilarious, so you should check it out if you haven't seen it. Lennon Lime, Seizure Robot and Boglum Chronicles. This entry on the iceberg is in reference to three King Cobra related YouTube channels. Lennon Lime is another Cobra highlight channel quite similar to Bite Size. Boglum Chronicles is a guy who stays very consistent with the Cobra highlights. He's like a Cobra news channel or something. And Seizure Robot is a YouTuber who does a really great podcast about King Cobra JFS called Snake Bones. And also makes these like crazy amazing cobra related animations you should really check them out these channels are all really something so if you're not like too familiar with josh and looking to get more into him these channels are all related to him and are all like active members of the community so please do check them out spice usage this entry on the iceberg refers to well fucking obviously josh's spice usage josh occasionally smokes spice on camera slowly killing what brain cells he has left i have no more to say about this than yeah don't do fucking spice that shit is so bad for you that shit is so dangerous stay away stephanie summer and gothic d this entry on the iceberg refers to some of the amazing women in josh's life like his first love and ex-girlfriend stephanie who has her own channel called vulpa drago i believe his ex-girlfriend, who totally doesn't kind of look like Justin Bieber, Summer, and Gothic D, a Welsh woman who he had some sort of beef with because she was being trolled by Josh's fans who kept claiming they were dating in her comments. You know, that's not something any woman would want to be associated with, so understandable. And I'm gonna leave this video here. Keep in mind, we're only like one and a half layers through this fucking iceberg, so there's plenty more where this came from. There's going to be a lot more videos about this iceberg. And I just love talking about Cobra on this channel, so I want to enjoy this one for a while. Anyways, 
I hope you've enjoyed this video. Leave a like. Do please subscribe if you're new here. Follow me on Instagram. The link will be in the description of this video. And continue to support King Cobra JFS by, you know, buying his wands and supporting him when he's e-begging. I'm Louie, and thank you so much for watching.